Wondering if and where to start if you have a bad power steering? Well, this is the sound of a bad power steering from the side, and another symptom is the steering can be difficult to turn right or left. Open the hood and you'll see the power steering pump, which is a similar look for all cars and trucks. Remove the cap, and the oil looks low on the gauge cap. Not good. Next, with the car running, you should notice the odd sound as the steering wheel is turned and the fluid is low. Also, look down below. I can see some oil on the ground. Oh boy, I get to clean this up. So you know there's definitely a leak somewhere. But why tow your car and or pay over 50 bucks minimum for a mechanic to tell you that there is a problem with the power steering when you already know it and see it. Instead, find the leak yourself. And yes, that is me waving at you in the reflection. These are the only supplies you need. The approved power steering oil for your vehicle, a funnel, doesn't hurt, but most importantly, you need a UV light, ultraviolet light, and some UV dye. I'll put all supplies used in the description below for quick reference. Now I'll show you how to do it. But real quick, if this video helps, please like and subscribe to learn more tips, tricks, and hacks for your vehicle. Anyway, here's the solution. Pour some power steering oil in near the top of the reservoir. Next, pour some UV dye in. You'll only need about a tablespoon. Just a drop. The good news is you'll have a, enough left over <laughs> to use this on your next car leak problem. Oh, great. Next, have a partner turn the car on and ask him or her to turn the steering wheel all the way to the left and to the right. And apply pressure hard on one side for like five seconds. At the same time, you will be shining your UV flashlight, which is purple light, at the power steering pump area and its hoses to pinpoint the leak. Did you see it? You'll see it again. You'll know you found the leak when you see green fluid spitting or bursting out like a fountain. Not purple, green, like the money you'll be safe. <laughs> in fact, please let me know in the comments if this video helps and saves you money. Now remember, you may only see the leak when my partner applies pressure to the steering wheel all the way to the one side and with the UV light. Here's a good example on how to communicate with your partner to find the leak. Okay, turn the wheel again. Stop. Do it again. Stop. Okay, do it again. Okay, stop. That's my leak. Now that I found where the leak is, I know the problem is the high pressure hose and not the return hose. Unfortunately, I'll need to replace the entire hose, as a high-pressure hose cannot be patched up. You can see me replace this hose in a different video, which I'll leave in the description below. Now, hopefully you won't have a leak and just need to top up and add some power steering oil, or you can try a power steering repair fluid. But, I tried it and it didn't work for me. But if you have time, go ahead and try this before swapping out the hose. With that being said, if this video was quick to the point and hopefully helps you better understand your problem, then please like this video and subscribe. Mention in the comments your thoughts on this and please let me know if you do this yourself and save money. Until next time, check out the other helpful videos on this channel and always think how to fix car yourself. Bye!